sawona baba ninjani sikhona mabe siyavuka ninjani siyaphila this is how loud you have to speak for 62 year old Simon Bohali to hear you but he's hoping that very soon this will no longer be the case he lost part of his hearing in 1983 while welding at work he's had two previous operations and believes this time it will be a success mama nyativa tindlebe ukuthi tona into etinhlupha ko but ingijabula ngaso sonke isikhathi njengoba ngitiletse la mine ngendlela engifuna ukuthi ngifuna ukuba yiyo ngikwathi ukuva ngoba sesikhathi ngihleti nayo senye nda nje nama senye nda kathathu operation yale tindlebe another patient 40 year old tabo mulishiwa injured his ear and partially lost his hearing a few years ago on wednesday he was operated on and will soon have his hearing back for the medical team behind all of this the motivation is innovation um, i'll need to talk a bit so when you do the, the operation was very successful we are very happy uh, because it's so uh, it was our first and we knew that it's a patient who was slightly complicated but everything went very well we are happy is a new technology is a new development and uh, which can be used in any patient so if we sometimes if we take a ct scan or x ray of your brain we can see the bones that are damaged and recreate them exactly as they are so it will help a lot and it will be affordable so that's why we wanted to do it in the state hospital to be able to help our people this operation can be performed on new bones as well It uses 3D printed middle ear bones or ossicles which are implanted during the reconstructive surgery. Masogorahlaga, Pretoria.